what's happening everybody my name's Omnis and welcome to let's react to the Mandela catalog I had some people saying I should probably try this out after my last analog horror game and I don't know I've definitely heard about it never really looked at it though because at the time this was getting big the back rooms were getting big Oh, we're just starting off just like this. Let me turn this up. Countless reports of an unidentified we'll hospital organism that will refer to as alternates. Until we have a complete understanding of the threat, it's important to stay home, lock okay. all doors and windows, and have access to a loaded firearm or any ranged weapon at all times. You will know if an alternate exists solely based on their physical characteristics. If you see another person that looks identical to you, run away and hide. If People are scared of this? Has a biological Boy, this ain't nothing. Two seconds later. Okay, we switching levels. What, what's going on? In the event of an alternate encounter, follow the think principle. Okay. What do I do? The think principle. Tell an authority figure about your encounter. Hinder the alternate's movement. So, like, kill it, I guess? Man had an AK-47 a minute ago. Identify the class type. Yo, wait, is this like SCP? Neutralize the alternate. If safe to do so. Kill yourself. <laughs> There's not enough room for the two of us. <laughs> Yo, I feel like I'm on Reddit all of a sudden. Know your enemy. Type 1 Doppelganger, okay? Oh. Wait a minute. Wait a damn minute, that's kind of- Type 3! This is kind of inert. Oh! Oh, dude, they're going Silent Hill! Oh, I've seen that before. Oh my god. Guys, I don't feel safe anymore. I don't like this. Okay. Victim one, victim two. Mark and Caesar. So what is this? Like, uh, I gotta guess who's not the... Hey, it's Caesar. I hope it's not too late. No, it's fine. Don't worry. What's up? Are you right? Yeah, it's not me. It's my mom. She's knocked out cold and I have no idea why. I'm on my way to the ER, but could you do me a favor? Yeah, of course. What is it? Uh, I just need you to come over and turn on the cameras we have set up. Uh-oh! You know the ones that we installed after we were robbed? Oh, yeah. Why can't you do it? Do you mind it? if I asked why? Yeah. Well, she screamed really loud right before I found her on the ground. I, I just... Well, do you have your doors and windows locked? Like what the broadcast told us to do? Oh, it's set to our yeah, broadcast. that's the weird part. Maybe she saw something? I don't, I don't know. Oh, he's lying. Uh, I mean, it shouldn't be too bad. I'm just gonna switch them on and get out of there, though. You know how I feel about your house. Dude, dude. Yeah, that's fine. One last thing. Try to get a good view of the I fucking knew it! He's fake! Oh, dude. Why would your friend ask okay. you to do that for you, dude? That right, I gotta go. I almost at the hospital. Yeah, Thank I bet you. you are. I bet you are. You don't even sound like you're in a car. Oh, my God. He's in a... Oh, wait. Or Is this Mark going there? It's gotta be Mark, right? Dude, this is unnerving as shit. You know Mark's gonna die. Yo, we're gonna take a chance. Volume at 100%. Oh! Oh. Oh my god, it's a lot loud. Okay, we're going back down to 60. I didn't know I could get that loud. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Dude, this is way louder than it was just a minute ago. Holy hell. Oh my god! Everything's so loud all of a sudden. Not because I turned it up. Dude, 
dude. <laughs> I can't do this. Mm. Wait, so he's leaving. Motion detected at... I just kicked my light. Motion detected at 3.31 a.m. I got... I kick my feet when I'm nervous, so I keep kicking my light. Let's sit up. Let's get ready for this. I'm not scared. It's just a video. Wait, was that... Is that like... Was that like that before? Yo, no. No. Someone broke a window. Yo, that thing was shut, dude. Somebody came in. Uh-oh. Uh, okay. Okay, dude. Sound increased detect. I, my, my volume's too high up. Don't do this. Who are you? Get, get away from me! No! No! Oh! I'm turning this down, man. I'm turning that way down. It followed me home, Caesar. Me and Mark, I have a gift for you. you, you. I have a present. I, I have a surprise. I don't like this. I don't like this. Guys, I'm getting like, I'm getting freaking goosebumps. I don't want to see what is on the other side. Dude, I wouldn't either. It's like, literally, screw that. But it has been days? Yo. And nobody has come to help me. Oh, hell, dude. <laughs> Did he shoot him? Uh oh. Bad decision, Mark. Yo, yo, I kind of want to take these headphones off. I'm not, I don't like this. It's going to happen. I'm about to get jump scared. Oh, oh, okay. Thank God. I mean, it's kind of spooky, I guess, but I've seen a lot worse. Okay, so. How you guys doing? <laughs> if you'd like to make a call, please hang up and try again. If you need help, hang up and then dial your operator. <laughs> okay. If you'd like to make a call, please hang up and try again. If you need help, hang up. Nobody came from Oh, he didn't shoot the monster. Oh. Now they're both gone, man. Jesus. Attention, viewing the following footage is illegal and punishable by, by law if not previously cleared with your assistant. If you have access to this recording and you are not part of the local authority, please stop. I guess I'm got Guess who's going to jail? To Emergency call operator. While at the station, a situation may occur where the local 911 dispatchers run out of operators to handle calls, so they are given to us instead. There are three and only three scenarios that you will handle with a caller. Let's hear him. Police. <clears throat> when a caller needs the police, send available personnel to the address. Fire. When the caller has a fire-related emergency, contact our neighboring fire department with the address and a brief description of the event. Yeah, I play dispatcher. I know how to do this. Medical. When the caller has a medical emergency, immediately contact the Mandela Community Hospital. Um. Oh, okay. Here at the Mandela County Police Department, we thank you for viewing this instruction. Encounter. Do not help a caller reporting an alternate encounter. No matter how frantic their screams are, but why? Calmly reassure the caller 
that help is on the way. But you said not to help them, though. The call can be ended when they stop responding to your questions. What? Do not speak too much. You might accidentally reveal your fear. Nothing is worth the risk. Nothing is worth the risk. Nothing is worth the risk. What do you mean? Toddler stress assessment video. Record your child's response to the following media. I'm probably like white as a ghost right now. <laughs> Section one. Record response. Um, <laughs> funny noise. <laughs> See, this is going to sound weird. This has always unnerved me. Just the sound effect. I don't know why. Just imagine hearing that late in the night. Like you wake up at like 2 a.m. and you hear that and you don't have a kid. Let's see what the next response is. Okay, yeah, yeah just some goats. I mean, I'm going to be honest. If I heard that at 2 a.m., I'd probably, I'd probably shit myself too. Daddy didn't tuck me in. And there is a man in the closet. Oh. The Scary Night by Mark, age four. Okay. School, Mandela Elementary School, grade 4K. Okay. Daddy didn't check under my bed last night. See, this one I think I might be okay with. So I went to mommy's room. Was she a, uh, I was scared. There was a scary knocking on the door. Okay. And the scariest part is walking by the desk room, but by the dark room, by the, ugh. and the scariest part is walking by the dark room by the stairs. Scary, dark me. Okay. So that's weird. You got like a door in between the steps. Almost at mommy's room. Then I saw the man in the corner. Uh, -uh. They switched to a picture right now. That'd be the perfect time to. Oh, well. Okay, well, you know, I'm a little bit less terrified. And then I fell asleep. The end. Okay. Section two. Okay. You're losing me on this one. You, you had a strong start and now you're, you're failing, man. You're failing. Okay, now I'm a little bit more scared. I don't know why that balloon kind of irks me a little bit. Yeah, I don't like that either. I see why he was kind of freaked out. Is it like, is it moving? Is there, is, dude, is that a face right there? Yo, yo, you scared the shit out of me. Yeah, okay, my wife just scared the hell out of me and I had this man staring at me the whole time. I have a feeling this is not gonna hit the same way it was supposed to. Let's see. Did I mute it? An intruder. Yo, this guy, I, I feel like I've actually seen a guy like this at my school before. Module complete. If anything unexpected occurred during the test, let your advisor know. The Mandela Catalog, Volume 1, created by Alex Keister. Okay, so I guess that was the Mandela Catalog. Um, it really hit hard at the beginning. It kind of fell flat at the end, but I think that's because I, you know, I had to take a pause break. <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I think it was pretty okay. Uh, it's not nearly as scary as people said, but then again, I saw there was like four volumes when I got this one off of YouTube, so it probably gets a little bit worse. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, like it. If you like this type of content, please tell me down in the comments. And if you love this type of content, subscribe and hit the bell for notifications. It really helps. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.